Hello everyone. Hope you have a good day. Uh, today's topic will guide you how to protect your website by using XSS file. The implementation of XSS file will not allow any unknown users to log in. Only the users with the username and password will have access to your page. So without any wasting time, let's start. Go to your root project folder. Here I will already put open my test file test project from the chrome and the right side is the visual studio i already opened uh, the index html so i don't want to keep the access to everyone so those who have admin admin password detail will can only access the this this file so for those purpose uh, i'm doing right i'm doing now right now is from the access file so I will type the st access dot access and another is dot st uh, e a s s w d right so in the st access file I write down some code uh, name a u t t a p type uh, basic a u t a password to take a area should be a double column and after user file uh, here you have to uh, put your the um, this file path you can show there from the url from this here uh, e column e column jam st st docs and uh, test dot dot st is a wd okay that's it and enter require valid area save it and in here another icp as a password file you have to add something uh, generic code so for that generic code you have to go to google dot google dot com Type your ST AS password generated. Here you will see the first in generated code. Type your admin or your own username. Type your password. You can type your own password. Very, cons very confidential. Create HTTP. This will he will give you the reasoning with generated code. Paste it here and paste it. Copy here from here and paste it here. So now we will see here in the problem box. Sorry, you have to log in. Mm, seems like we are sticking here. HTTP test uh, protected area. Author name is a file require valid something is wrong. Uh, to find it myself, uh, name password protected area basic offer user file e drive. Still not working. Since I have forgot something, uh, std password mm, is okay. Std std httpswd stss valid area require authentic username file e jam let's see docs test the password you are you have to the password okay it is still not working auth basic uh, auth name 
password protected protected area author username is our other user file require valid area sorry valid users it should be users here now you can see the pop-up right so here yeah, we can do the admin 